would there be any advice that you would give to businesses that may be thinking about trying to take this a bit more seriously? You know, they maybe they're just starting their salon. Maybe it's somebody that is literally in the building foundation stage right now of starting a salon. What stage should they reach out to a company like you? I think, to be honest, connectivity should be high up, one of the highest. Obviously, you need your, your aesthetic a bit, so your, your furniture and, and maybe the wall dressings, etc. But connectivity has got to be right up there for us because, as we just touched on, that's a backbone of any business. Yeah, that makes sense. And how have you found it at Sound International today? What kind of questions have you guys had at your stand? Have there been any anything, that's in, any kind of interesting conversations that you've had with other salon owners? I think the main one is we're, we're here basically today in, in this event is to spread about the big 2025 switch off. So massive awareness piece in the industry. We, we went to Pro Beauty North two, two and a half weeks ago, uh, did a quick survey. We asked 200 people. Is that all salon owners? What do you guys know about the 2025 switch off? I, I don't know what that is, so no. do you guys know what that is? Okay, one person in the crowd knows what that is, so do you want to just tell us?